do you really want to create a free WordPress website? And this is video for you guys. Today we are going to create a free WordPress website without having knowledge of complicated coding. If you remember, I already made a video on how to create a free website, but some people have trouble with that. Like a uh, hosting company now doesn't provide free plan. So I have to have find another way to creating a WordPress website and now I'm here. I'm back with another video. So today we're gonna get a free domain from the different company and we're gonna get a free hosting from the different company and we're gonna combine them together and we will create a free WordPress website. So in order to avoid any sort of error, please don't miss any single step that I'm gonna show you in this video. So watch this video till the end and in the end you will have a successful WordPress website. So enough talking, let's jump straight into the computer. Let's create a WordPress website. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe or you can turn on notification by clicking this notification bell icon and you won't miss my new uploads. And also you can leave a like if you've been enjoying these videos. Alright guys, let's get started. Let's create a free WordPress website. First of all, you need to open email account. Any email you want. I prefer Gmail. I open my Gmail account as you can see. Let's open up a new tab and open google.com and here perform a google search for infinity, infinity free and let's open up this website in new tab and perform another google search, free norm. Let's open up this website as well. So guys if you never been in this website before you have to sign in or sign up. Let's click this sign in. Here you can use your social network. I will use my Gmail account. I'll select my email account. Now click start registering your domain name. Now search your domain name here. Now click check availability. As you can see, if we scroll down, these are the free domain and these are the paid. In our case, we have to go with free domain. Select your domain type. Click get it now click checkout in the period you have to select 12 month free period and now click use DNS now click use your own DNS now leave the space as it is just for now we will come back here and we have to type name server here let's go to this website infinity free so we have to sign in or sign up now click on here sign up now now complete your registration process. Now click sign up. So as you can see, now we will get a verification email in our email account. So let's close this tab. Let's go to your email. As you can see, now we have new email from Infinity Free. Now click confirm your email address. As you can see, message says Thank you for confirming your email address. You can now create account. Okay, let's click this create account button. So as you can see now we have two tabs here. On the left side we have subdomain. and the right side we have own domain. Enter your domain here. Let's go back to this website. Let's copy your domain. Let's go back to infinityfree.net. Paste here. And now you have to copy these name server. Go back to free norm and paste here and paste here. The difference is you have to change this number one to two. Okay. Now here you have to press continue. Now click here, sign in as your email account. Now here you have to enter your billing address click this box I read and agree to the terms and condition now click on complete order now click on here click here to go to your client area click this drop down button of services and now click my domains now click manage domain now click this drop down button alongside management tools now click name server 
as you can see now we have only two name server so we have to copy and paste here control V like that but we have to change these numbers let's change it to 3 let's change it to 4 let's change it to 5 okay now click on change name servers now go back to infinityfree.net now click on this search icon now check this box now click on create account as you can see status says creating which means we have to wait for a few minutes a few moments later let's refresh this web page as you can see status says active so now click manage now click control panel so guys now we are inside C panel let's scroll down so in the software section you have to click here software Colossus apps installer click on that and these are the applications so in our case we have to install WordPress let's click install now delete this WP scroll down give the name to your website you can give description as well you can change username or you can change password now scroll down you can change your email now scroll down now the last thing you have to do is click on this install button now click on that in just a second you will have your wordpress website like that and there you go so at this point of time you can access your wordpress dashboard by going to this link or the same link you will get by email at your email address if we go to our email as you can see this new email address here let's open up this web address or right, guys if you're watching rmss like this or something else at this point of time you don't need to worry about it you just have to wait for few minutes after five or ten minutes i think your wordpress dashboard will open successfully so i'll come back and i'll show you guys uh, this is a work perfectly sometimes what happens is uh, dns uh, name server could take time to connect with each others once they connect your wordpress dashboard will open successfully so you have to wait for a couple of minutes 20 minutes later so guys let's try to open this wordpress dashboard web address again your domain name slash wp admin let's open this up so guys as you can see now we can access our wordpress dashboard after login and your username and your password all right guys as you can see now we are inside our wordpress dashboard here you can customize your wordpress you can visit to your site by going to this link so this is your wordpress website looks like you can change your wordpress theme you can add a post anything you like so this is how you can create wordpress website with new way all right guys that's the end of this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you face any trouble you just ask me one time in the comment section i'll try to answer those questions as quickly as possible and if you want me to create more videos for you guys you just have to ask me in the comment section which type of video tutorials you want although i create motion graphics and visual effects and after effect templates in this channel if you are interested in that you can subscribe to my channel and don't forget to press that bell icon alongside with the subscribe button and once you've done that you will get to know what and when i post a new video so that being said goodbye and see you next time